Gavin Gee here from UltimateReloader.com. I'm right here in Alabama visiting the Creedmoor sports team and they got us into the Anschutz North America facility. And I'm here with Austin. Austin, thank you, man. Yeah, man, not a for problem. For showing us around. Yeah. So a lot of my viewers don't really know about Anschutz. Let's talk about kind of the company and the products sure. that so, you guys import me. Sure. So Anschutz has been around since 1856. Mm -hmm. They're based out of Ulm, Germany. Um, their main focus is rim fires with the, the competition scene, the Olympic scene. Mm -hmm. um, we also do air rifles for that same discipline. Mm -hmm. uh, and we also have center fires for the, the hunter or shooter who wants something a little unique, a little different. Mm -hmm. uh, and all of our products will come from Creedmoor. They, yep. uh, they can get our full line of products and, and get it for you in any way you want. The one thing I'm picking up on here is all of the products are for the hardcore enthusiast, whether it be a competitor or someone that just wants extremely, extremely tight craftsmanship, amazing quality. Absolutely. <laughs> uh, it's, it's German engineering at its finest. Yep. <laughs> okay. Do you mind showing us around the rest of the facility? Yeah, absolutely. I can't wait Come to on. see this. So in here we've got personal collection guns. We've got some Meister grade guns. Uh, and what's, we, a, what's a Meister grade gun? A Meister grade gun is a hand selected uh, wood, wooden stock gun and it's also hand selected for its test target accuracy. Okay, um, so it looks good and it shoots good? Yep, and then <laughs> uh, we also have you know a, a collection of just regular walnut stocks that we can choose from for Meister grades or people can come hand select their own stock. This, I, I could spend hours in here just <laughs> looking over oh, all of these fine firearms. Absolutely. The test targets that are here. Yeah, so we we match a test target with each gun. Um, you know, they, they shoot it in Germany mm -hmm. uh, and it's serialized and then it's also got the CD manual that, that comes with it, but each gun will have one of those. Mm -hmm. That's awesome. <laughs> So this is interesting to see kind of the final product. Uh, yeah. Why don't we take a look at some of the stuff that you guys do here internally, getting the guns ready and all that? Sure, yeah, come on. So back here, we've got the shop. Um, we, this is where I guess all the magic happens per se. Yeah. <laughs> uh, you know, we'll, we'll assemble guns that come in as yeah, barreled actions and we'll fit them to stocks ship out to customers. We'll, mm -hmm. we'll build guns based off of customer specifications. Um, and then we'll repair guns. We're the North American Service Center. Mm -hmm. um, so anybody that has a problem with them, we'll, we'll obviously take care of it, fix it, get it back running. Um, and it all happens back here. It's a little cluttered right now <laughs> from the Christmas rush. Hey, but... it's a lot cleaner than my machine shop. <laughs> <laughs> it looks like a laboratory in here. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> well, uh, and then Back here, we've obviously got the warehouse. Yeah, you want to show us around back sure. there a little bit? Yeah, we'll, we'll go back here. Um, yeah, this is where all the inventory is. Uh, it's, it's guns, parts, ammo, and it's uh, in a state of disarray from Christmas, but <laughs> we've, we're making it through. So this year, 2020, has been a little crazy. How, how has that affected your stock or your business, shooting sports, does that affect you guys very um, much? It's, it's slow, slowed the sales down some at the beginning of the year. Mm -hmm. um, you know, when everybody got told to stay home and couldn't go anywhere, but it's it's picked back up and, and we're actually doing pretty pretty well right now. Uh, getting stuff from Germany has been a little, a little slower than normal, just based off of them being under lockdowns and yep. all that other stuff. But for the most part, it hasn't, hasn't slowed us down much. Now this ultra precision rimfire ammunition, you know, when we go through these cycles where there's shortages and all that, how does yeah. that translate to your stock levels and um, that kind of thing? Our stock levels right now are, are a little lower than normal and it's mm -hmm. taking a little bit longer to get shipments out of RWS mm -hmm. for the ammo, but the, the stock levels are, are pretty good. Mm -hmm. um, you know, we, we obviously don't deal with the, the bulk pack stuff that everybody buys first. We've got the high end, precision ammo so it's mm -hmm. not on most shooters radars right but but we have a have a decent stock of it now so you've got rifles here you've got ammunition here i'm thinking maybe we put the two together what do you think we yeah, do a little absolutely. shooting you want to go down to the range and shoot now i've heard about your underground range i want the tour yeah <laughs> yeah come on
The guys here at Anschutz have set me up with this bench rest rim fire rifle. Let's see what I can do with this baby. Would you like to walk down and look at the targets? Absolutely. Let's go see it. So we made our way back into the shop. I'm here with Brent Books again from Creedmoor Sports. Thank you for making this trip happen, by the way. Yeah, absolutely. <laughs> Got a customer rifle here. Right, yeah, so we got customers waiting in Aniston right now for these. I uh, wanted to show uh, kind of the difference between a regular rifle and Olympic style rifle. So any- You're calling that a regular rifle? <laughs> no, these are not a regular rifle. <laughs> these are the Olympic <laughs> rifles. I mean, that's one thing that I've noticed, you know, coming in for more general purpose sporter rifles or PRS rifles, everything is completely adjustable on these. Everything is completely optimized for the shooter, for the sport, everything. I mean, they, these truly make a regular rifle look very, very general purpose. Right, you should never have to adapt to these rifles. You adapt the rifles to yourself. So yeah. any, anything that you can imagine, you can adjust these to, to, you know, to make it work for you. So let's walk through each of these different rifles to compare an air rifle to a, to a small bore. Right, so this is a small bore rifle here. This is the air rifle. Uh, they both are gonna have extremely adjustable butt plates on them, your length of pull, uh, your cheek piece can go up and down, back and forth. Uh, you got your palm shelf here to raise and lower the muzzle when you're in standing. They've got the hand guard or the handrail underneath uh, to put your palm stop or any other accessories mm -hmm. you need on there. Uh, you can put risers on for your sights. The pistol grip can be moved all around and the trigger is extremely adjustable for all different kinds of settings. You know what really amazed me about these rifles, these Anschutz rifles, is the accuracy. So, Oh, absolutely. We were just down there shooting mm -hmm. and I had one enlarged hole for five shots right. with the, the bench rest rifle. And then, so that was at 50 meters. A uh, 10 meter test card on the air rifle that we just checked out is basically one hole. It looks like the diameter of a pellet. And there it is right there. <laughs> that is accuracy. Yep. Oh man, this has been fun. I wish we could stay for longer, but uh, why don't we go say goodbye to Austin and yep. head back to Innocent. We got customers waiting at home. All right. Let's go. Well, that was a lot of fun. I especially enjoyed shooting in that underground range. Thank you, Austin, for the awesome tour. More than welcome. And if people want to know more about these awesome rifles and these products, www.onshootsnorthamerica.com. Plus, and I'll have links specifically in the video description and that accompanying article, Creedmoor Sports carries these products. They carry these rifles. They help support these products. They've got the RWS ammo. That stuff's shot awesome. It does. It shoots well. <laughs> So if you like the video, if you like Anschutz, please give this a thumbs up. Also make sure you're subscribed with notifications because you're going to want to check out my trip to Talladega CMP range. You're going to want to check out my visit at Creepmoor Sports and more. Thank you for watching. Until next time, happy shooting and happy reloading.